The Dallas Cowboys could easily have seven or eight Super Bowl victories when you go back and examine the tape. 1979, almost 45 years ago to the date, Steelers versus Cowboys in Super Bowl 13. The one Cowboys name that I hear from this Super Bowl more than any other from my dad, from older fans, is Jackie Smith. Jackie Smith was a legendary tight end. He made five Pro Bowls and ultimately was enshrined in the Pro Football Hall of Fame. What I know Jackie Smith most for, sadly though, is this drop which happened late in the third quarter of Super Bowl 13, with the Cowboys trailing the Steelers 21-14. The Cowboys of course were forced to settle for a field goal, cutting the score to 21-17. A Franco Harris 22-yard touchdown run would put the Steelers up 28-17 halfway through the fourth quarter. What happened next in my opinion was a bigger blunder than Jackie Smith's drop and I have no idea why I don't hear more about this play when Cowboys fans relive this Super Bowl. Steelers kick off after the Franco touchdown and Randy White has probably one of the worst fumbles I've ever seen in my life. Bradshaw throws an 18-yard touchdown pass to Swan on the very next play and the Cowboys attempt at a late comeback fall short. Petition to make this the Randy White fumble game over the Jackie Smith drop game. With the Cowboys ultimately losing 35-31, the seven points that the Steelers got off of that turnover kinda sorta made a difference. That being said, some of my old school Cowboys fans out there, drop me a comment, give me some education on this one.